what's up my name is Kelsey if you're new to this channel welcome I'm really glad you clicked on this video I've gotten a lot of things over the past few weeks I am rearranging things in my house I'm decorating I'm remodeling I'm doing all the things so there's a lot to show you so let's jump right into this ever but I'm gonna talk about it and it's so random that it just feels weird because I've never talked about pickles on my channel before <laughs> but these deserve a shout out and it's really funny because if you watch Jacqueline Hill she just posted a snacks video and she talked about these pickles and I was like thank you somebody gets it these are the best pickles in the whole wide world in my opinion they're in the refrigerated section so you probably won't see them in like the aisle where you normally find the pickles. The reason why I'm mentioning these right now is because I just finished this jar so we don't have any more in our house. So I thought that they deserved a mention because we go through these a lot and really fast. So yeah, if you're a pickle fan, you will love these. Since I was talking about food, I might as well talk about kitchen things. These right here, I just got in the mail about a week ago and I love them so much. I'll try and get up close so you can see the detail. They are gorgeous. They come in a set of two and I've been using these for my olive oil and then this one has my balsamic vinegar. And I just wanted something because we have the Costco sized jugs of balsamic vinegar and olive oil and it just got really annoying whenever we were cooking to take that whole jug out. So these are sitting out on my counter. I got these at Macy's. They were on sale. I think they were originally somewhere around 30 or $40, but I got them for $19.99. So I'll leave them linked if you guys are interested. Just makes life a little bit easier for us. And then I think I might have talked about this before, but it deserves another shout out. It is this really cute garlic container. I got this from the Target dollar spot about a month or two back. I love that it says garlic there on the front with a cute picture and I just always need a place to store my garlic. In the past I would just always end up putting my garlic on the counter and it didn't have a place and so I was so happy when I saw this. It was only three dollars and I like that it's all contained in one cute place. I just went to Ikea a few days ago. We finally opened their in-store shopping. So me and my mom went there the other day and it was just nice to feel some sense of normalcy again. Our home goods is opening next week. So you already know there's gonna be haul videos and home decor updates coming. Anyways, Ikea, let's focus. I got these two bottles from Ikea. I liked the print on them. They're just like these really gorgeous bottles that you can put anything in. I actually got hooked on these by a blogger, Alex Garza. You might follow her on here. And I think these will look really cute on our patio um, whenever we're doing like a summer barbecue or something. And they just pop off like that. I got two because I wanna put filtered water in this one to leave out by my husband's coffee station area because right now we have water, actual plastic water bottles and I wanna stop buying those. My cousin really got on me about that. So I got this to fill it up with filtered water. That way he can just fill it up whenever he needs. Oh yeah, and these are really cheap. They were only, I think, $2. So it's definitely a good buy. I have a basket here of different Ikea stuff I'm gonna show you. First are these little guys right here. You're probably wondering what the heck are these? They come in a set of three. So I have my lemon right here. I just wanted to show you guys what they are. So this happens to me all the time whenever I don't wanna put um, my halves in a Ziploc bag for avocado, um, lemon, cucumbers. I do this all the time with cucumbers. Whenever I cut a cucumber, I'll have the remaining half that I don't know what to do with. So I found these and I think they're really smart and genius. It's just like a cover that you place over whatever item you're wanting and it looks like that once it's done. How freaking cool. I love that they're reusable. You don't have to use any Ziploc bags. I just think it's so smart and really convenient. I'm gonna be using this little cucumber one all the time. I eat cucumbers, I think, every single day at some point, and I just love this cute little guy. They come in a pack of three for, I believe, 
three dollars they are really inexpensive um, they are in the kitchen section if you're wondering obviously why wouldn't they be but yeah love them I didn't realize how many kitchen things I got the other day these I'm really excited to show you guys I am obsessed with their Tupperware I love these natural wood lids I just think it looks really beautiful and just matches the decor in my house they are airtight containers and these lids I believe are three dollars a piece and the glass jars are $2.99 I believe so not too expensive what I love so much about Ikea is that so many things are personalized you can kind of create your own look for whatever you're going for just like their closets so with these Tupperware if you don't like wood lids they have a huge selection of different lids you can pick from and then these glass jars come in so many different shapes sizes there's just a crazy huge selection which I love Next, I got some salad tongs. These are just basic wooden salad tongs and they were really inexpensive. I think these were around $5.99. I really liked that the base of this was white. I think it's really cute. And again, for summer dinners and stuff, I don't have any salad tongs in my entire kitchen and it's always annoying when I'm trying to mix everything. So needed to pick up that. And then I got some really cute paint brushes for Kenzie. I got her a watercolor um, paint kit last week and so I wanted some new paint brushes and I liked obviously the natural wood detail in them. These were only $2.99 so such a good price. I picked up two of those. And then lastly I have this really big white bin. I loved this bin when I saw it online. I really like that it has a wooden handle. I'm just going to take it apart so I can show you guys. This is called the Risa Torque Basket and I believe it's $12.99. Here is what this basket looks like. I love it. I just think it's so simple. And that's been kind of my decor style lately. I'm going for more boho, simple design. I just love wood elements. Um, white anything. I just want it to look really clean and simple. I originally got this basket for Kenzie's chalk, but now that I'm seeing it in person, it does look pretty big. I don't completely know what I'm going to do with this yet. I think I'm going to store maybe her outdoor toys. She has a bubble machine, a bunch of different things she plays with out there, so I might fill it with stuff like that. It's just a really beautiful, sturdy basket, and again, the handle just makes my life easier. Okay, the next thing I'm going to talk about is my entryway. I have a lot of clips I want to show you guys of how I put my entryway together. It's not completely done, but it is almost there. I just need one more item. I'm looking for a bench to put your shoes on and stuff. Me and my mom had a lot of fun decorating this. She came over, helped me out, and I wanted to show you guys what I found and how it all came together. So let's start that now. Life is a winding road No telling where it goes Driving through days and nights Won't stop for traffic lights And I I really wanna know, really wanna know If I Will ever figure out where the road goes Even if I'm falling down I will keep on searching for my highs Say I lost my mind I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start from the ground And I, I really wanna know Why is it so hot when guys put pencils behind their ear? When they're working? <laughs> no really, I always think that I mean granted it's a pink pencil, but still <laughs> Maybe because women finally feel like the men are getting projects done so it excites us you know I really wanna know, <laughs> really wanna know if I let me figure out where the road goes even if I'm falling 
falling down I will keep on searching for my highs Do you love it? Say I lost my mind, I will keep on holding my head high Even if the sky is falling down Even if the sky is falling down The sky is falling down Even if the sky is falling down Did you like how the entryway turned out? I'm really happy with how it came together. I just wanted a really simple, clean space. Whenever you walk in, it just feels cozy and inviting. It's just nice that this place is starting to feel like a home again. The gallery wall really helped to bring it all together and make it feel really homey. So I hope you guys liked seeing that. Also, I didn't show you guys this a few weeks back, but it was Kenzie, my daughter's birthday just a few weeks ago, and she got the cutest present and I've been meaning to show you, but I'm gonna insert some clips now of her opening it to show you guys what it is. So let's go. Are you ready, Kendra? Yeah, ready. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. What is it? <gasps> you like it? You want me to open it? Yeah. It's opening. Is it a horse? Yeah. What? It's good. Should we open it? Yeah. <laughs> you want to lift it up with yeah. me? Okay, lift it up. Oh. Good job. You got it, baby. You got it. You're doing so good. <gasps> <Yeah>. <gasps> Wasn't that so adorable? I have been loving that pony. It's just so cute seeing her riding it. She rides it around our house. She rides it outside. It's just her favorite thing ever. She treats it like it's her own pet. She'll grab the tie on my robe and like wrap it around the horse and like walk him around the house. It's really, really cute. It was the perfect present for her. She's been obsessed with the show called Spirit and it's about horses, so she was just really excited. But if you guys are interested in that or have any kids that you think would love that, I'll leave it linked in my description box. The company is so awesome. Their customer service is amazing and it got here so fast. Um, it's called Pony Cycle. So I'll leave all of their info in my description box along with the link of her specific pony. They have a few different options. There's a smaller pony and a larger one. I think Kenzie got the larger one. Um, but yeah, so cute. Okay, moving on. I just checked my mail and there was a goodie bag of different things that the company sent me. And I honestly didn't even know they were sending me stuff. So I will show you guys what they sent. It's by the brand called I Do Care. It is the cutest skincare brand. They have a huge selection of different products, but their packaging is such a win. This says it's their buttery vitamin C lip mask. And this is what the packaging looks like. It just has a cute little smiley face on the front. You open it up and then there is um, the tool that you can use to obviously take out the product um, right here. And then it looks like that. I can't wait to use this tonight. It's probably gonna be sitting by my bedside table every single night. I am obsessed with lip mask. I'm always doing different lip masks. So they sent me quite a few different lip goodies. Um, and then quickly, I just wanted to show you tomorrow we are having a party with one of my mom's friends who is moving uh, across the states. I'm obsessed with this overall dress. I think it is gonna be so beautiful on her. It has like those eyelet 
details at the bottom. This dress is of course by Oshkosh. They have the cutest kids clothes ever. They have the whole line at Target. I don't know about the whole line, but they have quite a few items at Target in this line and highly recommend them. This dress was $17.99 and then we got this shirt to go under it. This isn't by Oshkosh. I think this is Cat and Jack. Um, she's in 5T clothing now, which is crazy. I think it's going to be really cute paired together tomorrow with her little sneakers and ruffled socks tucked over. So that'll be really fun. Another thing that's really random are these car air fresheners. I'm showing them because they smell so good and I like that they're like little watermelon prints and I think, yeah, the scent is watermelon but it smells so good so summery and fresh so i can't wait to stick these in my car i got these at target they were like 2.99 but love okay the last thing i'm going to talk about in this video is my jewelry i think i'm going to do a whole haul because i have a lot of new jewelry that i am obsessed with i have been inspired by a blogger that i follow her name is sweet tea with maddie i believe her name's maddie um but she always wears the most amazing necklaces and earrings and i'm always like where the heck did she get them? So then I looked at where she got them and they're really expensive. I think they're like $100 each and girl was not trying to spend that much. So I of course took matters into my own hands and went on the Amazon and found some really similar pieces that I love and the quality of these feel really nice. So I have this one right here which is like a paper clip chain. I've been loving the paper clip trend right now. I just think they look really cute and elegant on. I am a gold girl. I don't wear any silver uh, jewelry. And then this one, I don't know if you can see at the bottom, is a snake chain necklace. And it just looks really pretty, I think, paired together. Maybe I'll pull this down. These are both under $15, so really inexpensive. And I hope they last and keep up. I've only had them for about a week now, but I really like it. So yeah, that's basically all I'm going to talk about today. I feel like this video is going to be long, but I haven't updated you guys in a few weeks. I did take last week off from posting videos. Um, so I missed you guys. I hope you're doing well, staying safe. And definitely, if you are not subscribed, you should subscribe right now because I have a lot of home decor videos coming. I am remodeling our patio. Um, and also, I'm showing you the remodel of our floors. We just got hardwood floors from carpet. That was absolutely disgusting. So yeah, there's a lot coming in the next month and I want to do a home tour because I know you guys have been asking for that. That is everything for today and I hope you guys are doing good and I'll see you soon. Bye!